Batman? Looks like someone brought a bat to a knife fight. Why aren't you dead yet? <laughs> Welcome to this year's boiler deck fight. You know I always get a laugh by you first round. <laughs> That's why I keep you boys around. Enough's enough! Well, that and I need someone to clean up the pizza. <laughs>
geezer. Proper naughty. And he deserves a right proper welcome, don't he, lad? You just saved me a lot of trouble coming here, bad man. I'm gonna kill you. Then I'm gonna jumpstart your heart. And kill you again. and I'll crush your larynx. What's it going to be? All right, all right. Uh, he's in his office. Only way in is through the theater on the other side of the casino. But you'll never get past Tracy. Tracy is not a problem. That worked better than the last interrogation. Someone as paranoid as Black Mask wouldn't trust a loudmouth like him with any secrets. If I want to find Sionis, I need to find Penguin first.
decrypt the data drive. Looks like it's part of a larger set. If I can collect enough of these, I should be able to read the file. on the lamb. I should have tied him up and called the cops to get him. Alfred, I had a run-in with one of the assassins, Lester Baczynski. The electrocutioner. Are you all right? Yes, but he managed to escape. His gloves put out a strong electromagnetic pulse. If you can isolate the signal, I'll be able to track him down. I'll get to work on that. Where are you off to now? I'm on my way to the final offer's casino. I'm going to make Penguin's assistant show me to her boss. must be nearby. I'll make her tell me where I can find Cobblepot's office. Did your password? It must be Pendus. It's always Pendus, bro. Should I go bring it to him? You serious? We gotta move this cash. <laughs> Mr. Cobblepot ain't taking new visitors, and there ain't no way I'm letting you into the theater to see him. 
so you can be on your merry way. Show in the door, lad. is controlled from that security room. enough she can tell me what to do. Yeah, you're right. You can't let him get the upper hand. That's what my dad always said. Of course, Mom would slap him right after. <laughs> Let's kill this son of a bitch! herself a dry slap she has that better be lip gloss you're reaching for come on let me out this ain't funny i knew you didn't have what it takes to fight me fast Shocking! 
What do you want? I didn't do nothing. Who's your boss? What does Penguin want with him? Alberto Falcone. But I got no idea what Penguin wants with him, I swear. I don't know what your game is, but old man Falcone will be in your debt if you take Cobblepot down. He's right through that door back there. No thanks. I don't need the Falcones in my debt. Mr. Falcone's gonna kill me if I don't get Alberto home alive. You suggested little Alberto over here. Hey, baby. Try to convince his father to take early retirement. He disagreed and called you a, let's see, psychotic little bastard. No, 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 please! <laughs> 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 You best listen, Falcone. Cause this is the last time I'll ask. What are you gonna tell your father? That we're getting out of the weapons business. I promise. I'll make him do it. <laughs> I see your lips flapping, Bernie. But they ain't making the sound I want to hear. You idiots better keep me. Please, don't hurt me. You. Kill them, you bloody wankers. Come on now. Remind me why I pay you for this. Don't kick his ass, you nutty. Are you waiting for a personal invitation? No, get in arrest. What are you waiting for? Punch him in the face! Don't stand there! Kill him! Kill him, you bloody white guy! Oh, he's the army! Come on now! Remind me why I pay you, punk! Now hold on! Hold on a bloody minute! I've seen your act. I ain't done nothing you've not done. Stop. Black mask. Put a bounty on my head. Where is he? I don't keep tabs on him in Giza with a grudge. You're not a popular bloke in this town. You're running out of time. Wait. Wait. Lacey Towers. There was a murder. It was supposed to be his same house. But all black man. He's got problems of his own, I'd say. Someone broke in there. <laughs> Don't regret that! 
You bad man. Feel free to let yourself out. <laughs> I can't let Penguin get away. There's more I need to ask him. Strokes device to get up to the balcony. I can use the new tool I took from Deathstroke to grapple out of here.
gibbies than getting into this room. Go on then, beat it a bit harder. Really make me feel it. Well, as you can see, I got the answer. Have a Merry Christmas and piss off. Alfred, see if you can find any information on a murder at Lacey Towers. Hmm, looks like the police are on the scene now, sir. Oh, and this is interesting. They're saying Black Mask is the victim. Black Mask dead. I'm on my way there now. claw I took from Deathstroke could be useful here. Alfred, get GCPD to take a look at the final offer. More to Dixon Docks. They'll find Slade Wilson tied up and waiting for them along with some of Penguin's illegally obtained weapons. Uh, another anonymous pip? Will do, sir. Citizens of Gotham, your cries for help have been heard. I am Anarchy, voice of the people. My hunch was right. These drones are the same as the one I found in Blackgate. This once proud city, those hired and elected to keep us free and safe, won't lift a finger. Then why would they? They've been bought and paid for, encouraged to turn a blind eye. If they won't act, I will. At dawn's first light, the sources of Gotham's ruin will be destroyed. Now, back to your regularly scheduled programming of propaganda and consumerist garbage. As if there isn't enough going on tonight. I should hurry to Lacey Towers before the cops destroy all the evidence from the crime scene Penguin mentioned. I was hoping to get a minute of your time. See, I've got a story to tell you. Vengeance. It's also a story of redemption. Assassins in town. The batting gonna know what hit him. The cops investigating this crime should have a relay station set up. It'll look like a mobile satellite dish, probably on a rooftop. Enough's enough! for a smoke with a menace. Those men on the balcony, that could be my way in. Shut case. Penguin murdered Black Mask and his lady friend. I mean, we 
found the bastards. Got your little fingerprints right by the bodies. Yeah, we got Penguin now. Like to see him score him out of this one. Fingerprints, two dead bodies. He's about to do some time. Yeah. Police believe Penguin murdered Black Mask, but why would he send me here if he was the killer? It doesn't add up. This crime took place days ago. The fire and the exposure to the elements make identifying the victims difficult. The male victim is wearing a black mask, but I can't positively identify him as Roman Sionis without a DNA analysis. Something I can't do in the field. I can identify the female victim based on her fingerprints. Tiffany Ambrose, Roman Sionis' girlfriend, or one of them at least. She was no angel, long list of priors, but nothing to indicate she was the target here. Fire spread as a result of a Molotov cocktail thrown into the room. It may have been intended to destroy evidence. The shallow trajectory of the bullet suggests the shooter could be someone of Penguin's height. But the grooves on the floor suggest that the victim was killed by someone leaning back in a chair. This bullet was fired from a revolver. Ballistics analysis indicates a low angle of trajectory. The shooter could have been someone of Penguin's height, but the pattern in the gunpowder residue suggests the bullet was actually fired by someone lying on the ground. These fingerprints are a match for the penguin, but they're on top of the soot from the fire. The cops were right. Penguin was in the room, but these prints prove he was here after the murders were committed. If he didn't kill Black Mask, who did? The only thing I know for certain is that Tiffany's shooter was lying on the floor. But why? White streaks or shoe polish. Whoever shot Tiffany was being dragged along the floor. Besides the victims, there were two other people in the room. Tiffany's shooter and whoever was dragging the shooter. The location from which the male victim was shot may tell me more. The DNA here doesn't belong to either of the victims. Whose is it? The fight broke out when someone startled the shooter. It's not clear who won the fight. It could have been either one of them. I should review the evidence to see if I can learn anything more about either the intruder or the shooter.
fabric analysis indicates the intruder was wearing a white suit or sport jacket. This fabric swatch could help identify the intruder, but I still can't identify the male victim's shooter. There's one impact area I haven't checked for clues. This DNA is from the female victim. The level of oxidation suggests it's been here for several days. If I review the evidence, I may be able to find out what she was doing when she was attacked. She was sending text messages to Roman Sionis about someone named the Joker. Someone killed Black Mask, but this crime took place several days ago, and I saw Black Mask earlier tonight. I have raised more questions. Who is the Joker? Was he the killer here? Or is he one of the assassins? I have a body, an unknown shooter, and an unknown assailant who attacked the shooter. I need to match the DNA samples against the records in the National Criminal Database to identify who was in the room. Alfred, I need access to the National Criminal Database. Well, the only way to do that would be to infiltrate the Gotham City Police Department. Then that's where I'm going. Sir, you'd need to physically hack into their servers. If you insist on doing something that foolish, you'll need a powerful non-lethal weapon. I recommend coming back here to pick up your concussion detonator. Not a bad idea. Maybe we can... Welcome home, sir. The concussion detonator is on your workbench. Remember, if you use that instead of your fists, you'll do less lasting damage to those police officers and civil servants. Noted. Well played, sir. You stopped the electrocutioner with a single strike. I just used his arrogance to my advantage. A textbook move a child could have avoided. True, but I doubt the rest of them will go down as easily. If they do, we'll be eating that Christmas ham sooner than you think.
We might have to cancel New Year's at Wayne Manor. It's going to take a while for the city to recover from tonight. Absolutely not, sir. I didn't realize the party meant so much to you. It doesn't. Only, it's one of the rare times you actually seem to enjoy yourself. I enjoy myself plenty, Alfred. I hope you're lying. For both our sakes. Some of the assassins have access to rather interesting technology. When this is over, you might want to consider appropriating it. Let some good come of tonight's events. <laughs> 